Hey everyone, I'm Xunani. Welcome to my new video. Today there will be a little art haul and then I will try out one of these supplies with you together. I think you got spoiled from the thumbnail. So let's get started. All began with an almost full sketchbook. This is my sketchbook for rough sketches. It's for all kind of ideas, mini thumbnails and scribbles for projects or paintings. In this book I plan a lot. No, perhaps a tiny bit of color, but no color. Here every idea generally starts. I needed a new one and then my wish list was a bit bigger than I thought. Over two until three months now, I'm collecting new supplies I didn't find the time to try out and I would like to show you what I got and what's coming up next on this channel after Inktober is over. Finally! The new one is like the old one from Bösner Art Supplies. The paper is a bit nature wide, it has 170 GSM and for dry techniques like pencils, colored pencils, coal. Only the size is a bit different this time. I can't wait to start with this one. I will link you everything I show you and everything I will use in this video in my video description of course. What I bought then? I wished it for so long. It's a set of the Schminke Horadam High Granulation Watercolors, set Tundra. I bought them I think three months ago and I haven't had time yet to try them out in a video with you. Another reason is I wanted to have a better paper for it. Now I have so there will come a video review about these awesome treasures soon. Let's open this little box. Look at these tiny tubes of paint. It looks so cute. These are 5 milliliter tubes of color. The colors in this set are Tundra Orange, Tundra Rose, Tundra Violet, Tundra Blue and Tundra Green. As I saw this Tundra set, I was sure I want this one. I also like the set Shire, but I can't afford both. These sets come with so well planned, beautiful color combinations. I'm really looking forward to try them out. Then I bought this one. Perhaps two months ago, the Derwent Graphite Tint Paint Pen Set. I watched a lot of reviews about them and I like the shadowing, a bit dirty flair of these colors. These are paints made of graphite and pigments. In this case you get it in half pens. They come in a little plastic case. Here is a transparent paper which shows you printed swatches from the colors. I will make my own then, of course. They packed it another time in plastic and you get them with a sponge and a traveling water brush pen. Look at this! Do you see the shiny graphite on my finger? It would be awesome to work with them. Then I couldn't resist as I saw these, the golden high flow acrylics. I bought the set at a reduced price and as you perhaps know from my first YouTube videos, I love making art with acrylics. I painted only with acrylics for years bigger paintings and now I'm full in my mixed media obsession with watercolors and other mediums and stuff and these are very fluid like the name says. You can use it for airbrush as well 
or fill it in acrylic markers but and that's what I want to do is work with them with a brush like with inks. I'm really curious how they are and golden paints are always very high pigmented. I'm expecting a lot. You also can mix them with normal acrylics instead of water. Then you have your perfect consistency and more opacity. I think this will be an upgrade for me and my acrylic paintings. Yeah, let's see how they perform. But first we come to the next supplies. I'm so happy the Carandage Neocolor 2 watercolor pastels. I was in love for the first time I saw them and I was able to try them out at a friend's place. So I bought the 4D color set and this is what we're gonna do later. We will swatch them and try them out a bit because I can't wait anymore to use them. Look at these beautiful colors. See you later treasures. What I also bought are the three winner papers from my test. They are all from Hanemühle. Perhaps you remember the video in which I tested 14 different watercolor papers to understand the difference and find the right one for me. I got the Harmony 300 GSM cold pressed, perhaps for illustrations and making prints out of it for the regular stuff. The Expression 300 GSM 100% cotton paper cold pressed for special paintings and perhaps for original artworks for sale. On this paper I will use these colors next week. The Luxurious paints on the Luxurious paper and the Britannia hot pressed one, 300 GSM also. This paper is also perfect for aqua markers as well, I think. I love to work with them on it. So, but now, finally, let's try out these pastels. I'm very excited. I prepared a paper for my swatches, so let's do that. First I bring all the pigments on the paper, later I dissolve them with water. I love these colors and how high pigmented they are. Can't wait to try them out. But wait, I want to swatch this white over black to see what is possible. Nice, love it. I don't know what I will paint in my sketchbook. I'm just starting. We will see what it is in the end. Thank you. 
And again, this time I want to start with the background first. It's dry now. Look at this beautiful texture. I used a spray bottle with water when it was still wet. I love these pastels, they are perfect for me. I can use them with other medias or for themselves. I'm so happy that I bought these. We will become best friends, I think. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. Please tell me in the comments which of these supplies you would like to watch a review of in the next weeks. And if you already tried out the Karandash Neocolor 2 and how did you like them? It also would be amazing to get a like and subscribe if you haven't already. This would support this channel a lot. Thank you so much and see you next time. And of course, have an awesome day. Yours, Xunani.